My mind is fixed on Sussex. Bassam and I have a chance to save Sigurd. But we will need an army. That is for you to decide. The more alliances you have, the better your chances at victory. I will go now, and I'll bring Sigurd back with me. That is a promise. Good. I will send word to our allies at once. Meet with Basim when you can. He should be in Croydon by now. The breadbasket of Wessex, land of plenty. Luvina, once again we battle side by side. Greetings from the north, old friend. And how is your 
still griping about the mess we made of Jorvik's council. But grateful for the help. To be honest, I think he's upset he didn't see the problem sooner. His pride is slow to heal. Thank you for heeding my call, friend. Sigurd will be grateful when he hears you have come. For your brother, I would upturn every rock in England. Eivor, you giant steaming bowl of elk piss! <laughs> King Oswald sends his regards. Brother, brother. Or is it the other way around? It's... Uh, good to see you, Eivor. Oh, stop mewing like a heartsick kitten! He's been moping since the wedding. There'll be time later to reminisce. Are you madmen ready to spill some blood? After that bastard red, some nice soft Saxons will make easy meat for my blade. Eivor, my second favorite Norse. Must we always drift together on such violent tides? That is the way of things. Yet the meeting of friends is a glimmer of light in these dark days. Ever the optimist, though. It's good to see you both. I brought no pleasant words, only my blade. Let's see which proves more useful. I long to join this crew, one all Skalds will herald. There is always need for raiders. My chance will come. You wouldn't be the first man to fall asleep on watch, but you would be the loudest. I did not mean to fail you, Gudrun Jarl. It was only for a moment. I was so tired. As are we all, boy. We marched hard to get here. Still, let's not disappoint me again. You hear? My Jarl... I'm... sorry! You must be Eivor. I've heard much of you, young one. They say you're something. We'll see. Guthrum Jarl, Saxon Bane and Reaver of the South. I am honored to meet you at last. Respect where it's due. I like that. Here's hoping you fight as smoothly as you talk. Eivor hopes to rescue Sigurd from the madwoman Fulke, now ensconced in Porchester Fortress. If you wish to crown yourself King of Wessex, Porchester must fall. An alliance here serves us both. You promised a great army, but you couldn't breach a Kron's garden with what you have assembled here. This is not the sum of my forces. Where are the rest? Your allies are on their way. We must be patient. We cannot wait for them. We march as soon as we are able. With these numbers, are you keen to see Valhalla today? I'll not sit on my heels while Sigurd rots in that she dog's care. We might muster for an attack in the woods east of Porchester. But there are scouts between there and here. Scouts I can manage. Point me at them and I will blind Fulke's eyes. One walks the road between Briggsworth and Chichester, another on the riverbank north of Crowley. A third keeps watch on the hills south of Croendini. But I warn you, these are all we know of. There may be more. A risk we must take. I will find the scouts. You move the men into position near Porchester. That is a rash gamble, Ravenfear. If we are spotted, we will be vulnerable. If you want victory, come now or not at all. Every hour we waste could be Sigurd's last. You had better be all they promised.
survey the area soon. They said there would be a scout on this hill. I smell blood on the air. Show me what lies ahead. Stretch your wings sooner. Oh, God! Focus, Scout. Right where Basson said he would be.
do you see sooner? about us. Show me. Scouts are dead, and you're safely encamped. I told you this would work. Time will tell. Any eye that saw you has been dimmed by death. You are not short on confidence. That much is clear. A leader should not second-guess themselves. Nobody respects a tremble heart. I have known plenty as brash as you. Not many are left in this world. I found something of interest on one of the scouts. Folk has news of Croindonen's fall. She's gathering men and supplies, perhaps to weather a siege. If she is allowed to dig in at Porchester, it might be months before we can get Sigurd out. Do you still say I am reckless in my haste, Guthrum? Saxons! Saxons from the west! I say your haste has put us squarely in the shit. Fulke was forewarned. There must have been more scouts than we knew of. What's done is done. Save your breath for the fight. Mm-hmm. 
You dogs! Back to Porchester! They flee like rabbits! Then we chase them like hounds! That ugly bastard's head is mine! Not if I get there first, slow arse! Leave him! The day is already won! <laughs> <laughs> You Saxon! You'll join your friends soon enough! Is it for that withered bag of skin you fight? For Sigurd the Sickly? If Sigurd dies today, I will find your corpse and piss on it! deities like a plague to this land but you know nothing of those who truly decide our fate I decide your fate today Saxon I am ready for my final journey let me see what lies beyond I will not go and tell Fulke what you saw today tell her Eivor is coming to tear her heart from her chest I will tell Fulke her opponent is a weakling who does not have the stomach to finish what they started. Ah, you 
will regret this mercy. He's dead, Eivor. No breath within him. Gods, I've never... You are wounded, brother. Let me bear your brother to the camp. He was always quicker than me. Beat me out of the womb by mere moments. Now he has beat me to Valhalla. Even in death, he had to be first. This crow feast is my doing. No blame stains you, Eivor. He cut his own path. You always did. For him, there's no more strife and pain. Only glorious battle and the forever feast. Feel stronger already. Reckless stripling! I warned you the risk was too great! Peace, Guthrum. It is Fulke who merits your wrath, not Eivor. You have not seen the half of my wrath. How many of my men now lie dead on account of this glory order? You knew the danger as well as I did, Guthrum. You saw opportunity, and you took it. Indeed. The fault is none but mine for putting my trust in you. What happened here? Uba, Soma, you come at a black hour. And too late to bloody our blades. Most a pity. I hope to take Porchester with this one. But Folk is forewarned now. I have no more appetite for this. I will go west. Go then. But know you leave me in a time of need. What you need is to swallow your pride, raven feeder. Listen to wiser heads than yours. Eivor. I will hear you, Guthrum Saxon Bane, if you wish to speak your peace. You want your Jarl back? You must be cold as frost. Bravery is your enemy as often as your friend. We do not dash ourselves against hopeless courses. We arrive unexpected, strike swift, gather your allies, pick your moment. Then, and only then, you crush them. You can triumph yet. Go with the wisdom of Odin, the power of Thor, the wit of Freya. Go and find your brother. Guthrum spoke in anger, but there is wisdom in what he says. I heard and heeded. I'm not too proud to admit my mistake. Then there is wisdom in you as well. We will wait for our allies before the final attack. Until then, we have work to do. First... We need a new camp. The Saxons think we have retreated, but we will draw even closer. Here. Arrive unexpected. Erke, Stow, Juvena, ride there ahead of me. Together, we will bring them down. It brings me no pleasure to fight my own people, but a debt is a debt. Besides, they're men of Vasex, Alfred's folk. No brothers of yours. We will set off immediately. Together, we will fall upon them as Thor's hammer. After that, we should strike at Fulke's supplies all across Sussex. Yes. If she is allowed to dig in at Porchester, we will lose our chance to rescue Sigurd. The letter I found on the scout mentioned Bridgeworth, Gildefort, and Crowley. They produce weapons in Crowley. Food in Gildefort. Bridgeworth is a stronghold. Many Saxon swords there. Uber, I need your axe arm at Gildefort. Soma, you and your men will aid me in Crowley. Count on us. I will go to Bridgeworth and take a measure of things there. Good. I'll join you after I've dealt with the Saxon camp. A lion's heart and a crow's cunning. Guthrum judged you too swiftly. We have work to do. Let's be about it. Soma and Uber, I apologize.
I would have liked to offer a better welcome after your long journey. I'm only sorry we could not be here sooner. We'll need a short while to organize the men. Then we'll set off as soon as we're able. <laughs>